The following message is brought to you in part by Appel Health Services and Project Youth Link. World AIDS Day 2013. World AIDS Day on December 1st brings together people from around the world to raise awareness about HIV and AIDS and to also demonstrate international solidarity in the face of the pandemic. To understand what HIV is, let's break it down. Human immunodeficiency virus is a lot like other viruses, including those that cause the flu or the common cold. But there is an important difference. Over time, your immune system can clear most viruses out of your body. That isn't the case with HIV. The human immune system can't seem to get rid of it. Scientists are still trying to figure out why. What is AIDS? Acquired immunodeficiency syndrome is the final stage of HIV infection. People at this stage of HIV disease have badly damaged immune systems, which put them at risk for opportunistic infections. 1.1 million Americans are living with HIV infection. One in five Americans are unaware of the infection. By race, African Americans face the most severe burden of HIV. African Americans continue to suffer the most severe burden of HIV compared to other races and ethnicities. Blacks represent approximately 12% of the U.S. population, but accounted for an estimated 44% of new HIV infections in 2010. They also accounted for 44% of people living with HIV infection in 2009. Unless the course of the epidemic changes, at some point in their lifetime, an estimated 1 in 16 black men and 1 in 32 black women will be diagnosed with HIV infection. The Department of Health and Human Services encourages organizations to observe HIV and AIDS Awareness Days. So how can you raise awareness in your community? What type of events will interest your target audience? What can you do on a personal level? Get tested for HIV. Decide not to engage in high-risk behaviors. Tell people why this day is important to you and provide support to people living with HIV and AIDS. Our effort in Project Youth Link is to prevent youth our age from receiving AIDS and other transmitted diseases. Also for them to be aware of what it can do to you and why we are making our best efforts so you do not contract it. Getting to zero, Royal AIDS Day. Zero new HIV infections, zero discrimination, and zero AIDS related deaths. For more information or to take an HIV test, please stop by the Project Youth Link table immediately following 1015 service.